What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool Cool Kicks. We are back for another video out in San Bernardino and Inland Center. This is supposed to be the biggest mall in the area. But man, this place sucks. Like there's like no entrances, no nothing. Like I have to drive around forever. I have no clue what to expect. Let's go see. Let's go see what they got. Alright, we're starting this trip off with Shoe Palace. They pretty much have every chain here. So alright, let's look around. Let's look around. Club Shoe Palace in full effect. Dude, I think we might see more retros here than a lot of the LA locations. That's crazy, okay. We've seen these visionaries at a few spots. Mids, yeah, it is what it is. Got some lows. The 12s, I'm hoping to find these at the outlets. Man, some of these, I, I just want a discount. I'm not willing to pay full price because we have it like that now, now that these are being found at the outlets. Um, but yeah, got the 13s right here. Threes, core purple threes. Maybe if I found these at the outlets, maybe I'll grab these. More mids. The ginger 14s, we have not been seeing these everywhere. Only at several spots in LA, 210 for those. The sevens, we definitely have not been seeing the sevens. These bad boys go for 210 material, really nice on these color. I'm sound a fan of the color. I'm also not a fan of the sevens as well. And then the elephants, we have not been seeing these the desert elephants we have not seen these at most places and they do have them here size 11 all right and then you do have to be nosy out in the front section right here they do have the seven size eight and a half on display going for what two bills two bills for these great material they got these women's pairs right here and then they got these in grade school not in not in men's, but grade school they do have, okay. And then they got some on sale. The center course go for $70. Material on these, not bad. I'm just not a fan of the silhouette. And then these are also on sale too. I forgot how much these were originally. But yeah, $40 now. Oh, okay, the LS, Jordan LS slides. We've been seeing Pumas on sale lately. I've never seen this colorway. Okay, never seen these. $30, so not too bad. I'm just, I just don't really understand the color scheme. I don't know, is that for Christmas? I don't know. And then the all red one. This one, does it look kind of faded? I don't know, it looks kind of faded. It looks better on camera, to be honest. But yeah, $30 for these as well, the all red ones. And then the highs right here go for 35 Those are the only Pumas they got on sale today. Oh, they got these right here too? This is a size nine right here. Damn, I need the I need the upcoming shacks and stuff, so I can't really spend money on this stuff like this. The shacks are coming out. Um, Dan, I gotta get me a pair of those. So, um, but yeah, these are 130. I freaking love these, man. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to get one of these eventually, man. That that's just sick. 130 for these. The material on them, super nice, super super nice. Huge fan of these, man. And they got the pink ones. We saw these on sale somewhere. One or the other. Um, shoe palaces go for $90. Material on these, pretty decent. I just don't really wear pink like that. Alligator print converse right here. These are based off the Czech 70s. So normally super expensive, $40? $40, these are normally like 90 bucks or something. So that's a hell of a hell of a great deal. Wow, wow. If, if you're into if you're into snake skin, I'm really not, but. That's dope. And then these on sale. I, I just saw these for the first time like last week and it already says it's on sale. Go for $70. I'm sorry, $60, my bad. These are based off of the Chuck 70 as well. $60, that's pretty dope. Multiple colorways of the 550. Pretty insane how the sneaker game just changes so quick. <laughs> buck 10 for both of those. Oh, they do got the all white ones too. Okay, buck 10 for those as well. Checking out the grade school, which also works for the women. $80 for Air Max 95. That's actually a really, really, really good deal. Wow, that's dope. That's a pretty dope colorway, too. Looks small, though. What is that, size 6? Another grade school item, $79.98. So $80, that's not bad for an air more of tempo and whatever you see these on sale. Dude, got the Forrest Gump Cortez going for 40. Also got Superstars for 30, so not bad. Got, got a few deals in there. Oh wait, got the black and whites too? Black and whites too going for 40, okay. And then Jordans, we've seen a ton of J's in the grade school lately. Got a bunch as most spots do, okay. The 12s right there. And then the 13s right there. Dang, just people aren't feeling these. I've seen these at quite a few spots for a buck 20 now. These are the uh, Vapor Max 
Flyknit 2021s. Also seen these on sale quite a few spots. 100 bucks for Air Max 95s. These are the men's section right here that I'm at. I forgot to mention that. And then 50 for the Blazers. Kind of an interesting yellow. And this one dirty as hell too, okay. Then LeBron's, how much these LeBron's go for? We'll be seeing LeBron's on sale. 100 bucks? 100 bucks for the bread LeBron's? This is a pretty dope colorway. I still, I still kind of want a, a LeBron 19. I'm kind of iffy about the 20, so I'll probably get one of those for sure. Especially since they're on sale now. Then the Harachi's going for 70. I feel like those should be like 70. There's like no tech on it. All right, pretty decent selection. All right, let's go check out some more spots. All right, let's go. All right, we do got a Sheik. All right, let's go check them out. See what they got. We do got a little Jordan section right here. Pretty decent Jordan section, actually. And then do got the Stealth ones, Jordan 1 Stealth. Like I, I'm a fan of these, man. I'm a fan. Look at that lining, suede lining on the inside. Don't get that with most Jordan 1s. And material on it, pretty, pretty decent, dude. Hopefully I can find one of these at the outlets. Dang it. Stealth 12s. The 14s right here. 13s and then got some mids. Some mid Jordan 1. I don't even see that many sneakers here. Do got all the starter jackets. I'm a fan of these. Man, what are these? What, 140-ish, I believe? 130, okay. Got a Rams one right here. This is a Fanatics brand. And this is like different material. This is, uh, no price tag. No price tag. Come on, man. All right, who knows how much that is. Got a Raiders one. This is 130 as well. Okay. Mitchell and us t-shirts, Dodger t-shirts. Going for $55 for a t-shirt. Is that just me that thinks that's kind of preposterous? Even though they make really, really dope stuff. Like, I, I'm, I'm paying no $55 for a t-shirt. Serious? All right, dude, they got a bunch of apparel, Mitchell and apparel, $75 for these shorts. They have a bunch, a bunch of team apparel, jerseys as well, more shorts. Got a few sneakers right there, and then a few things right there, but nothing too interesting. All right, let's go. Let's go keep it moving. For some reason, I thought this mall was way bigger. Cash only? Cash only? Foot Locker doing cash only? What the? What the F? What the hell? So many cash only signs. Maybe their internet is down, what the hell? All right, dude, got tons of J's here. Got plenty, plenty. Zoom for threes. Apparently these are my beaters. I was doing some construction with these this past weekend. Oh, are these on sale? Okay, okay. Maybe these are worth worth waiting for these. Maybe I kind of like that colorway. These are even more, okay. Saw these for 100 over there now. Buck 30 here. If you want some vans or nike campus shoes they do have a bunch this one's denim obviously they have all of them on sale okay i don't know too many people that are into these but figured i'd show them since it is something different kind of seeing similar stuff a lot of the harachis on sale got some mb ones mellow ball ones i i don't know have i even seen this colorway i don't know but they do got them. I really have not seen this colorway. Pretty dope. Buck 20. That's a huge size though. This is a size 11 and a half, 12. I think it's a 12. Yeah. Oh, it's a... Oh, it's a US 13. I'm sorry. It's a UK 12. US 13. And then suede. We've been seeing a ton of suede on sale as of late. And then, oh, and it just keeps going and going. Going and going. Then the whole aisle on sale. Then got uh, some colorful uh, splatter paint on the bottom of that one right there. And even the MB1 colorway right here, the Mellow Ball colorway. Okay. And got a little sale on the little picnic table right here. All right, let's look, let's look. Great school LeBrons being given away for $60. Not bad, a few sizes. Oh, just uh, five and a half actually <laughs> and then the nola slides we've seen these the jordan nola slides got a couple sizes these are women's going for 20. hirachi grade school going for 50. got some girl scout cookies apparently they did a collab with k-swiss never seen these okay uh, which 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 cookie is this one though which which cookie is this i don't know is this the samoas is it the 
Obviously, it's not the Thin Man's. Which which one is it? Which one is it? Oh, it is a Samoa's. Also known as the Caramel Delights. It depends on which. They have multiple factories that make them, so it depends on which factory makes them. Some, sometimes they're called Samoa, sometimes they're called uh, Caramel Delights. So I thought that was kind of interesting to see a few sizes. Case was $20 for these. Those are $10. Those are down to 10 freaking dollars. That's funny. We got some Diodors right here. Okay. $10 for those. Jordans for $30. This is preschool though. Oh, this, these are awful. What the hell? Free runs going for 60 just very limited in the sizing though. Then more suede. These are going for 50. Okay, okay. These are the black five ones. Yeah. I saw the sign, I was like, what the hell? The Lakers stuff going for $30, what? Nah, man, they, man, they juked us. $70 for those. These are normal, like one something, right? No, $100, so slight sale on these. Remember, you can use the uh, if you have a survey coupon, you can use that for these. So, yeah, you'll be able to get it for 60 if you got one of those. I also got the pants. I also got the black ones. The black jackets as well. And then, like, there's certain things that are, like, cheaper. Like these uh, Adidas fleece shorts, $20. So, I don't know what the hell that, that sign is for. Maybe these these Jordan shorts? 45 maybe down to 30 I don't know. I don't know. Adidas hoodies down to $20. Okay, okay. The only really dope pair was that Pro Standard Lakers gear. That's about it. They got some of their summer stuff down to $10. Their locker brand fleece short. This ain't bad just to chill around the house. $10? Just to chill around the house. That's not too bad. That's about it, though. In the grade school sizes, got some sales, but nothing crazy. We've been seeing a lot of the same stuff on sale. Air Max Plus, been seeing a plethora of these bad boys on sale. Air Max 97s, all white. You get all that dirt for free. Like, they won't even charge extra for that. But yeah, $40 off of these. Air Max 95s. Okay, all right. We got some sales. You know, Nike free, free runs and stuff. But not, nothing crazy. All right, is that it? Did I drive all the way here for this? What the hell? Damn, I'm at the end of the mall. Is that it? I thought they had at least the champs on top of that. Maybe not. Dang, dude. Should we go check out, what is that? I don't know, Ashi Shoes? I don't know what, some bootleg shoe company? Or a shoe store right there. I guess they got a Vans? Okay, I guess. All right, let's check them out, I guess. All right, they do got a ton of Vans here. I don't really know much about the Vans though, to be really honest. I guess they have a Stranger Things collab right here. I've never really watched the show, you guys, so don't really know much about it. Obviously, that's one of the Stranger Things collabs. What are these going for? What are these going for? Oh, the price on the bottom. Buck and a quarter, 125 for these. Okay, okay. I'm sure plenty of you guys watch the show. I have to like try to find out which ones are the clouds, which ones aren't, because I don't really watch the show. But okay, okay. These going for these going for 90 for these bad boys. All right, these aren't a part of that collab, but these are kind of interesting. Some bones ones, or these some skate lows or skate highs. My bad. Skate highs going for what 90 dollars. Do you got a bunch of different colorways of stuff? Okay, okay. These are going for 95 right here. They got different silhouettes that I've never even seen before. Old school overt plus. So I guess it's like the old school but uh, way comfy version of that. That's what buck 15. Yeah, I've never even seen a lot of these. That's the name of that one right there. Never seen that one. Okay. All right. That's, I didn't even see the price. What was the price? Buck 20 for those, whatever those are called. Ultra range, are these like walkers? Are these both for skating and you just you can just skate for a long time knit material definitely did not see that coming uh, i don't even see a price for this one buck 20 for these okay they're called the ultra range v3 vr3s and these got a cool skate look to it uh, the athletics the wavies these are called the wavies 
Okay, okay. These are ninety dollars for these. Like these, these ain't bad. Those ain't bad. Dude. All right, got more of the ultra ranges right here. Different. Oh, different upper right because these don't have that uh, fly knit upper on it. All right, these are go for hundred. Got multiple colorways. And then got the Stranger Thing collabs for the itty bitty kiddos. All right, I think that's about it, dude. All right, let's just wrap it up. All right. That's pretty much about it. That is the Inland Empire mall experience. I think we're done, dude. We're done. All right, guys, that's pretty much about it. Um, yeah, that's probably similar to most of the malls that you guys visit, whether it's in Southern California and it's just not one of the big time malls that, that, I, like, that I show you guys, or if you guys live in other parts of the country, that's probably very typical that's probably very similar to to the malls that you guys are visiting i have noticed that a majority of the stuff majority of the heat tends to go to like the central stores in los angeles uh, out in hollywood um, los angeles that type of stuff so that's kind of why i've been focusing my attention out there that's why i've been hitting up some of the um some of the malls that i hit up more frequently than than driving out to different parts because that's where they've been getting all the heat and they've had better sales too they're higher volume stores, so um, you know they, they they need the shelf. They need the shelf room, so they will throw stuff on sale. As I've mentioned to you guys on numerous occasions, the malls, the outlets, it's all inventory management. It all just depends on how much stuff they have in the back. If they have a ton and ton and ton of stuff, they're gonna put, throw stuff on sale. If they don't have that much in the back, then they're not gonna have sales because they don't want it to shelves. That, that's just kind of the way it works. That's how retail works. That's how the outlets work. That's just. That's that's the sales game. That's how it works. So, um, so yeah, this you know not not the craziest stuff that I did see today, but that is uh, that that's probably most likely what you guys see at that uh, at your local malls as well. So um, it is what it is, you guys. It is what it is. You can't win all of them. And, and yeah, now I gotta drive. I drive an hour and a half back home. So we'll see what happens. But yeah, but thanks so much for watching, guys. Thank you so much for making it to the end. Uh, hopefully, all that information at the end is very useful. Um, it's stuff that I've repeated, but you know, I know that not everybody gets a chance to watch every one of my videos. So yeah, make sure you help a boy. Press that like button if you're new to the channel. Press that subscribe button. Click on that notification bell. Got plenty, plenty of videos coming. Y'all know I have a goal of a video every day. I think I've, I think I've thrown like four or five video extra videos on top of that this month, and hopefully I can continue that. But yeah, I got plenty coming. See you guys next one. Peace. People are probably behind me. They're probably like, what the hell? Why is that full talking to this camera? All right, we're out. We're done.